Hey guys, it's Ryler. We're going to be opening some Pokemon card packs today. One of them being the Sun and Moon Burning Shadows, which I know a lot of people are looking for. So I was pretty lucky to find that in store. Now I might struggle opening packs because I suck at opening things. That's always fun. Alright, we got Rhyhorn for the first one. Not really my favorite, but it's kind of cool. Ooh, a really nice Ralts card. Beautiful design. Stick that to the side. Alright, got a Tangela. We got a Tynamo. Cute. A Crab Brawler. Might have said that wrong. Weakness Policy, and uh, that one is a shiny. We got Electros, Energy, it's a Viper, it's a kid. So not really that great of pools on that one, sadly. Um, and here's the online code for anyone that wants it, because I don't use these. Another one I've seen a lot of people going crazy for is the XY Evolutions. So let's see if we get a hit in this one. Alright, and right off the bat we have a Charmander, everyone's favorite little guy, Magnemite, some energy, a little Growlithe, the Chop, and a Misty's Determination, that one's shiny. So another tra shiny trainer card, not the best of luck so far. Some Starmie, some Spirit Lynx. Alright, and for anyone that uses these, this is the code again for this one. So we also got Sun and Moon, Guardians Rising. Not seem to get my fingers under that. Right, and right off the bat we have a cute little rock rough and one of my favorite goonies slow poke cute little kamala he's a shiny oh wow we also have a shiny gudra which is awesome Alright, looks like a repeat, I think we already had that guy, got a slow bro, trainer card, and for anyone that actually uses these guys, there's a code. We also have just the base pack, Sun and Moon, of course getting these open with gloves on is fun. Little cutie fire in the front. Nice drowsy on the beach. Cute little Put him to the side. Oh, Toro Cat. He's cute. He's a shiny. From what I can see, this Polyrath is also a shiny too, so that's nice. Rainbow energy. And again, code for anyone that uses it. Well, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye. I just wanted to add in that I really don't think the Sun and Moon Burning Shadows is worth the hype it gets. I spent $40 on a pack of, you know, eight booster packs of these cards. And it also had some GX cards at the start. And I just truly feel like this is really hyped up 
and I've pulled a lot better pulls from like the Sun and Moon Guardians Rising or just the regular Sun and Moon. I've seen those in like the Cosmic Eclipse seem to honestly have a better pull rate. Though, you know, you can get the Rainbow Zard from this, but that doesn't always mean that you're going to. I've seen people go through hundreds of packs to get that, so sometimes it's just better to get the not as popular stuff. 